<laughs> That's my Patreon. <laughs> okay, so with that, let's start the show. Good evening, Money and Life Movement. JD Ramos here, coming to you live from Patreon. Welcome to my YouTube channel, and welcome again to JD's Random Thoughts. Mm. Patreon is getting noisy right now. Hold on a sec. Okay, <laughs> let's. It's, uh, I uh, uh, lessen. I lessen the volume a bit. All right. So before we start, of course, if you're on YouTube, hit that thing to subscribe and hit the bell so that you'll be in the loop when it comes to my channel. Now, if you're on Patreon, you're one of the luckiest people in the whole wide world, right? Why? Because, well, you get to see this episode two months in advance and live, okay? Live means totally uncut, totally unadulterated, even my stutters and pauses, you will see them, right? So what are we gonna, you got any burning questions? I have answer for it right now. like to well actually there's there's already a burning question I have in my head and I'd like to go back to episode 15 all right if you're on YouTube you can go back to episode 15 I I uh, told you guys there about my about the about my goal for my channel and I told I told you all there that it's that I'm going to end season one with either by either gun or the episodes. Then in I think episode eighteen, episode eighteen, I gave myself the goal of a uh, not even the, uh, not even the live, not even the, what you call this? Not even reality shows, episode seasons, okay? So I'll be, I'll probably be reducing the, uh, the goal of ending season one. Okay, let me, let me be clear, let me be clear on that. So season one will end if, If we have reached, if we have reached 50 episodes, or okay, I am not letting go of the 1,000 subscribers thing. All right. So that's it. So it's so season one will end either in 50 episodes. If, if we have reached 50 episodes or 1,000 subscribers, which comes first? Okay. So with that out of the way, here's my burning question to you guys. Do you uh, need to scale down your goals? Okay, that's our burning. That's my burning question for you. Do you need to scale down your goals? My answer is. Depends, okay. Depends. Okay. If uh, like what happened to me, uh, if a uh, what you call this, grim reality scenario happens, you need to scale down your goals a bit. Be more reachable, okay. You can always uh, you can always scale them up again. You can always scale them up again. But if there is no need to scale your goals, do not scale them down. Right? It defeats the purpose of goal setting. 
it actually defeats the purpose when it is totally unnecessary to scale down your goals do not do it do not do it because well like i said a while ago it defeats the purpose of goal setting right motivational gurus like bob proctor you set your goals ridiculously high right now actually not only bob proctor says this like i i even i even heard tom hopkins talk about this he too also said that to set your goals high so when that when the grim reality scenario sets in you need to scale it down a little bit like a, like, like like this like like this it's like Now don't scale down your goals to the point that it's that it's easy to reach. You won't work hard for it enough. Enough. That's what I've learned. That's what I've learned from well from you. Okay. The goals need to be Laser specific. <laughs> Damn, I could I could another term or right? laser specific. Right? There's there's such a term as why not laser specific? Okay. Need to be laser specific. It's a big no no to skill uh, to be to write down uh, general goals. Okay. Your focus, uh, your focus would be, you won't be that focused, actually. You won't be that focused when your goals are too generalized. This I learned the hard way also. That's, that's my take on, that's my take on my burning question. Now, I haven't seen any comments. <laughs> Come on, guys, give me some comments. Give me some comments. Participate in the chat. Okay. I really want to talk to you about about, about this burning question. Okay. <clears throat> Other guys? 